the kind of form, the strong form that you had at the end of the India tour, you've been able to carry on to this tour yeah yeah it's uh, it's been good it's, it's been nice to get a few runs uh, along the way this tour um the boys have obviously played some good cricket uh we've won all, all our games so far and and hopefully we can finish off with another win out here how would you sort of how would you sort of analyze i suppose that 100 you made the other day pretty happy with it yeah yeah it was good it was a it was seeming round a little bit early on so it was, it was quite tough to get through that um i guess it was just about being patient and, and waiting until the ball got a little bit older and, and things got a little bit easier then so um yeah for me it was it was good to, to to leave a few balls early on and and just wait for the ball in my areas and you know just i guess building innings it was it was it was the main thing i was i was pleased with do you feel like you're in a good rhythm at the moment with you with your batting yeah i feel really good at the moment so um yeah, look, I really enjoy playing cricket over here. I think these conditions are sort of the slow wickets and that are quite suited to the way I play. So, um, yeah, look, I enjoy playing on, on these wickets and, and the challenges of the, the ball swinging around as well. Because, yeah, people say your strength is, I suppose, playing spin bowling, but you feel like um, in these conditions, um, you know, the ball seeming around that you're on top of that as well? Uh Recently, yeah, I feel like I've when I've cha- I've changed a few things with my technique that have um, that have helped me. I think I've, I've tightened my technique up a little bit, so uh, yeah, I feel as if um, I'm batting really well at the moment, and, and hopefully I can continue and get another big score out here this week. Yeah, so it's something you sort of knew you needed to work on a bit and improve. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, look, it was um, you know I probably didn't start off my my test career, I guess, as, as well as I would have liked, and you know to to go well in India was was big for me coming back into the side and I guess just putting my name up there again and um, you know I'm really pleased with the way I've batted this tour and, and hopefully I can continue it on into into our summer as well. Do you think you've grown a lot over the last couple of years you know with you know getting dropped and sort of being out of the picture for various amounts of time do you think that's really grown you as a, as a player? Yeah I think so yeah look it's always when you get dropped you always look at yourself and, and see what you need to improve to I guess get back to that level and I feel as though I've changed a few things with my batting that have, have made me improve as a player and, and hopefully I can continue to improve with, with every game I play and every season I play. And captain for Australia A for this upcoming tour in Africa, um, you, you're pretty happy with that mate to, to get the captaincy and you know, you're obviously being viewed as a leader for the future? Yeah, it's, uh, it's very exciting. I've, I've done a few little things, I guess, captaining with the, the Big Bash and, and that, and I really enjoyed that role. So, yeah, I'm looking forward to South Africa being in charge there and, and hopefully we can continue the same brand of cricket we've played over here and, and get a few more wins on the board. You're captaining this game, Steve. You, you must be looking forward to stepping in and um, Brad's obviously set a really good example in this game, but now you, you, he's handing those reins over to you. What, what's, he, uh, what's he told you and what kind of um, advice has he given you? I guess just keep playing the same way we've been playing. Um, I can't expect too much else, you know. We've played some very good cricket so far. Um, the batters are doing a good job scoring hundreds and um, the bowlers are, are taking the wickets. So uh, there's not too much else we can we can really say. I guess just carry on the form that we've, um, you know, we've showed throughout this tour and, and hopefully we'll finish on a good note with another win. With um, with Brad and, you know, you've, pl- you've been lucky, I suppose, in New South Wales. You've played with a lot of guys like Michael and Brad and... Um, Simon Cage, the leaders. But what have you sort of gleaned from those guys that you know you can now bring to the to the table as a captain? Yeah, obviously the they're all very professional the way they go about their business. Um, you know, they're all different, I guess, in their their ways of leadership. And you know, I think I've learned a lot off of Brad, particularly the last this tour and and with the Sixers and New South Wales, I guess. Being, being around the last couple of years so um, yeah look he's, he's been one for me that, that I've really learnt off and you know hopefully I can I guess continue to have the successes he's had as a captain So do you think you're most similar to him in terms of your style? Uh, I don't know really um, you know it's, it's, it's always good to you know to learn off these guys and, and try and I guess mimic what they sort of do but everyone's everyone's different in their own right as a leader and yeah look hopefully I can I can be as successful as he's been